In 1971, a score of men and teenage boys using axes and picks nearly destroyed a house reportedly bought by a black man married to a white woman. 200 residents stood by and watched. Since then, more than 10 acts of violence have been aimed at the few blacks living in Rosedale. The tension escalated with the coming of the Spencers. In the summer of 74, Tony and Glenda Spencer bought this seven-room house on 136th Avenue. Before the Spencers moved in, their house was set on fire with gasoline. They moved anyway. On New Year's Eve day a year ago, while the Spencers and their sons slept, a pipe bomb exploded on the porch and smashed through the windows of the house. Police said the bomb was intended to wipe out the family. Attached to the bomb was a note that read, Nigger be warned, we have time. We will get your firstborn first. them out their neighborhood and throw rocks and start hitting them. We don't bother the white people around our neighborhood, but when we get in a white neighborhood, they, they just push us Treat out. Yeah. Everybody, Everybody was a citizen, so we're nothing, you know, they were a piece of dirt, dogs. I mean, that's the way you treat an animal. I mean, God, we're human beings. Yeah. You don't treat other people like that. It's just wrong. Black, white, don't care. A person is a person. Skin should have no bearing on how you treat a person. That's just wrong. I hate that goddamn gut. Do you forgive them? No. No. Out. No. Can't take back no hurt. But they go. They gonna always do that. They always spit on us like we some dogs. They always gonna back do that. on them. Ain't nothing. Ain't nothing gonna change. In 1971.